I'm going to introduce you to Ian, the Drakensberg hiker. He's the one leading this whole expedition. He's getting ready for our trip to Lesotho. I can't wait. What a beautiful day. And there's a lot to go into these three Land Rovers. He's got three. He's got this one, that one, and then that bad boy over there. The, the ultimate adventure vehicle, I think. Whew. Thank you, Jeff. Where are you as a matter of interest? Uh, behind the airport. We are at the bottom of Sani Park. We're just stopping to have some lunch under the trees. Good old picnic. enjoyed my nice chicken salad. <laughs> Thank you, Gene. The more you respond to my comments, the better. And then I tell you a whole lot of stuff and you get more out of it. You know what I mean? So if I say a joke, you must all laugh. No one laughs, laughs at Ian's jokes harder than Ian. <laughs> that was freaking hilarious. <laughs> So you guys must know that when you're driving up Sony Pass, it's going to be over 8 kilometers, 1 kilometer higher, 10 degrees colder. Be ready. Hey, we just made it to the South African border. That's Lesotho right there. We're going to go into Lesotho now. It's at the top of Sony Pass. You definitely need a 4x4 vehicle to drive up that pass. And don't forget your passport. out of 10 that I come up here, the same poor guy is walking up this hill carrying wood for his community at the top. Isn't that just unbelievable? Why don't you offer him a lift? We've tried, but I don't think the elevator goes all the way to the top floor. <laughs> We're almost at the top of Sony Pass and we found some dragon snot, apparently. <laughs> dragon snot. It's the Drakensberg and that looks like snot. So it's dragon snot. We've just made it to the highest pub in Africa. That's the road we just drove up now. You can't even see most of it. It goes all the way down there. And these guys are making some banging music. Is that for me, bud? Can I have some money? Lesotho, you get Maluti beer, right? But their currency, their money is also called Maluti, and they call the Drakensberg Maluti, so everything they love is called Maluti. <laughs> How many Maluti does a Maluti cost? Cheers, Cheers. Cheers boys and girls, welcome to Lesotho, Maluti. <laughs> the mountain Cheers. kingdom. Just arrived at the lodge. As you can see, Ian is doing what he does on the roof, and this is our view. <sighs> These are the rooms. Keeping warm with this fire over here, and I don't have a bed. Good morning. This is where we slept last night. Slept with a fire. Let me show you around. We didn't really use this area, but it's nice that it's here. And uh, yeah, all in all, nice, cozy place in the Sutu. 
best part is there's no Wi-Fi. It was nice to dis disconnect. Yeah, most of these people here are a lot happier than the people that live in the big cities. These little kids are all running around and they're free and they're happy and... Look at these young ladies carrying water all the way to their home. Dumela! We've been driving for the past two and a half hours and we just pulled over to the side over here for a little snack. And as you can see behind me is the start of the Orange River. That is the fifth biggest river in Africa. And it starts just up the road and it flows all the way to the Atlantic Ocean. Downtown Sabateka. This is where we're stopping for lunch in the middle of Lesotho. We have just left the downtown bustling metropolis of Sabateka, which in the local language means the mountain that is ablaze. Bit cold, a lot colder than it looks. So we got these Land Rovers and some good food coming. Guys are making some new friends along this Camino in Lesotho. About a 15 minute walk. And look at all my followers so far. Hey, there's five followers, guys. This is what happens when you chase Africa, guys. You make new friends. This is where we're camping for the night. We're setting up Rai or Poiki just beyond these Land Rovers. I'll show you. This is Katsi Dam, and this is where we're going to be spending the night. Katsi Dam is the highest dam in altitude in the whole of Africa, 2,200 meters above sea level, full of trout, which is amazing to me that trout actually breed better here than they do in Scotland, which is not even half the altitude. Eating tonight. We're having a lamb poiki and butter chicken. And this is your kitchen. So chaps, I want to show you my beautiful wonder bag. You just bring it to a boil and you put it in this beautiful thing. And then you open up here and look at this rice. Oh, really? And that is only after five minutes of boiling on the stove. 40 minutes in the wonder bag and look at that. Fantastic! Fantastic! It's butter chicken. Oh. Born up a tree. Oh, <laughs> I'm speechless. <laughs> About 6.30 right now. Ian slept here last night. Look at that, that's actually for us. Yeah. Good, bright and beautiful morning. It is 17th of June. Today is my birthday. I'm 28 years old and I'm starting my birthday out here in Lesotho. And let's slowly head back to Durban. You must start the day properly because it's your birthday. Have a little tutu whiskey over there. Bottoms up.